Good morning, Sculpture One. For your assignment today, um, I want you guys to create two designs for your boss relief carving. And these carvings are gonna be in these plates with a bunch of plaster in them. So they have this very round bottom and it's about like five, six inches in diameter. So you guys can just grab a random piece of paper and draw two circles, or I just grabbed tape I found. That's roughly, you know, five inches six inches in diameter and just made two circles this way. So with this assignment, you need to think about a foreground, middle ground, and background. You need to have at least three levels of depth in this. So for example, um, I can have like a tree right here and you guys can design whatever you want. You're welcome to look at reference images. But, you know, I'm just gonna make something very simple here. So let's say I have a tree and then there's some like land over here and then I got some mountains over here. So that's a couple of levels of depth. So for example, this will be my background. This will be the area that's the most carved away. And this right here will be my foreground. That includes um, the tree and this ground over here. So this is going to be the most forward towards me, the least carved away area. And then I have these kind of two hills, so we kind of like have a mid-ground here and another mid-ground here. I'm requiring at least three levels of depth, but this one has four. There's one, two, three, four. Um, things you want to think about as you guys are working on these is please stay away from skinny things. So for example, lettering like this, if you want to do letters, you want to beef them up. So I'm just going to come in. Um, if I was going to write Bear River High in initials, I want to really, let me switch markers, beef up the letters so they're not so long and skinny. The reason why is because long skinny letters are going to be a lot more harder to carve and they're going to be more prone to breaking. So same thing with like fence lines, for example, if I'm doing a fence like this, I want to beef up the posts quite a bit or any kind of lines that I have so they won't break on me as easy when I'm carving. So again, you guys are welcome to do whatever. It could be something very simple like a logo you've designed. Um, like this, you need to also think about at least two different kinds of textures associated with your relief. So example, textures could be like the bark on a tree, leaves on a tree, um, water, or if I have something simple like the Bear River High, I can think about, okay, what kind of textures can I make, carve, and create when I'm doing this? So maybe I have a bunch of lines on this one, for example. Anyways, two different designs. Demonstrating foreground, middle ground, and background. You won't be allowed to carve until I pass off your designs. If you have questions, please shoot me an email.